Sorry for the glare here. I thought I'd do a quick review of this knife. Uh, I think I have uh, called these CNC knives before. It's not like there's a lot of workmanship to it. It's basically somebody with a CAD program and uh, access to a CNC. But I do like the unique type of designs and, you know, if it's pressed, you know, uh, you know, handmade, which I would prefer, but I don't have, uh, what is it, hundreds of dollars for a knife handmade. But these are just, these are machine-made knives and they're pretty handy. This is, this is called a falcon and it's a dagger. It's like, I don't know if it's six, seven inches long or so. And this is something I just, I'll just hang up somewhere. It's, it's a neck knife, but it's a big neck knife. So it's not like one that's going to be a very uh, valuable stealthy. Uh, other than the fact it'll be in the, on a neck, on a sheath, possibly underneath your shirt. And uh, basically it's a, it's a straight dagger. Now it's only sharpened on one edge because it has to meet the requirements of many jurisdictions and in most jurisdictions or quite a few jurisdictions daggers are not uh, legal in this case it has a serrated part or a serrated edge and a dagger part so it could be used to tear or cut something uh, but this is basically a punch tool uh, I'm not advocating it to be used for the design what the design would demand but I do like to have neck knives it's pretty handy and if sharpened correctly, they're pretty handy if you're going to, uh, you know, you just need them. I just, I wear a very small neck knife normally, uh, all the time. And basically, I take it off, cuts, slices, or trying to reach uh, areas that I can't reach. Then it's just very handy. So it's not like any neck, any knife is functionally anything more than any other. But this is just a unique design. And I liked it, and it's and like I said, most of my knives are purchased because of design, and I do like this, and I usually keep it in my keep it in my bag. Uh, you know, it'd be pretty handy, and it has a reasonably sharp edge, uh, but not but not razor sharp, so it could be sharpened considerably. And if it wanted to be used as a dagger, which I would be careful of doing, according to your jurisdiction, because daggers are you know, daggers are uh, illegal in Quite a few jurisdictions but you can also sharpen the other edge it's sort of one of those wink wink nudge knives don't do this but you could do it uh, so i want to give you a quick look at this and this is a like i said i get these little cnc knives every once in a while they're relatively inexpensive i don't know this might be 13 bucks uh you know compared to bench mates which are hundreds 100 bucks or if you know some of the other you know, along that gradation between garbage knives and the designer knives. <laughs> so I just want to give you a quick look at this. And like I said, it's something you could you could carry with you. And if you need to be in a position where you need, where you might possibly have to, to self defend, this could be useful. But uh, I'm not uh, in any way saying this should be used as an offensive weapon. But it's just a pretty handy little knife, and I just like the design. I don't know why I just like the design so that's that's the majority of my knives i just like the design with the, with the exception of my very expensive swiss army knife which has uh, you know massive functionality within a within a uh, small range so don't think you gotta you get a swiss army knife and you can do everything but you can limp along and do quite a few things with them but this is just a single use type of knife for cutting shaving punching and I don't, and punching can be punching through clothes, punching through canvas or anything along those lines. You could also use it as a boring tool to some degree, uh, but I wouldn't, uh, wouldn't uh, put any heavy demands on it. But if that's all you got, then that's all you got. Okay, I just want to do another quick knife review. I'll be back doing my normal stuff. I don't really know if anything I do is normal. I just like to do a wide variety of things and you'll see it on this channel. Uh, I, one thing this channel has is a massive lack of focus of which I'm exceedingly proud. I will talk to you later. You have a wonderful day.